If you guys want any cheap MSP, PSN codes or cheap game codes, make sure you go over to G2A.com and use discount code B87 to get 3% off your total order. Hi guys and welcome to another video by myself Bateson87. A while ago now you will have remembered, uh, well you may not have remembered, a video I did on the fake players. Now some more information has come to light about these players and I'm about to uh, explain it to you. It looks like EA are going to be releasing some new teams into Ultimate Team. Now these are not teams uh, like the likes of the uh, Orlando um, and the other MLS teams. These are actually different looking teams. Now there was a guy who tweeted Kazooie the day after the Fate Player video did go live and he managed to glitch out the servers. Not on purpose, he did it by accident. Um, and it was before the match day update. On the screen now, you are seeing three new teams. One of them is called UNICEF with the UNICEF logo. One is called Ultimate Team, uh, nation name two, underscore 221. And the other one is the same as well with a different logo. Now, these are three teams which I don't know, but they do include some of the players which were in the fake player um, fake player list, which I did show you when you search it on the transfer market. So as you can see here, here are the three team lineups of the um, of the teams. All of them are fake players. All of them have ratings, which you thought would be happening. A lot of people were saying the fake players were going to be legends. Now, I knew that wasn't going to be happening because of the fact it was on PlayStation. We still do not know who the players are exactly but hopefully that will come to light in the next couple of weeks maybe EA might release them it might be something to do with the African Cup of Nations it might be something to do um, with the charity work with UNICEF and stuff but the 86 rated player and this is the guy who actually um, did glitch out the servers and find it he said it's an 86 he said the 86 rated player was from the Ivory Coast he had three star skill moves and 30 years of age just like Yaya Toure so that points me towards Jaya Turi. I don't know why. Well, obviously, there's only one 86-rated Ivorian in the game, but Jaya Turi is 31 years of age, if you check his age on foothead. Now, I don't know if that's changed recently. It might, it might have been correct at the time, but it looks like the UNICEF team is going to be including Jaya Turi. I don't know exactly how the teams are going to work, how you're exactly going to be able to pack them, but there is have been a few videos around, and if you do watch FIFA Rally, you will have seen his kit video, which he did at the start of Ultimate Team, where he was able to check all the new kits. Now, there is the Legend kits, and he showed all three of them in his in his club. Um, if, I, might link a, I might leave a link down below to the video of FIFA Rally, so you can go and check out um, you can go and check out the kits which are in there. Now, there is also some more kits in there, uh, not just the Legend kits and the Legend logo, which I think only one person has got access to at the moment. I think that is uh, Herpsef. Herpsef's got the uh, Legend kits and logo which he uses and plays on Ultimate Team. But there is some other kits as well, and them kits are the ones you are seeing from the teams, the uh, white Ultimate Team kit and the black Ultimate Team kit. Now, the UNICEF kit has never come to light um, and I do know a few people have talked about it but you can see it on the screen there it's a it's a nice uh, like light blue um, UNICEF logo on the middle no badge no sponsor and obviously the fake player on the back now I come across some footage of someone playing with the glitch teams he's playing with the UNICEF team and the ultimate team as well not sure what it is and all of the players are fake players you are seeing this in the background now so is there going to be a new add-on added into Ultimate Team? Are they just going to be implemented as like special teams, but obviously players from the database currently, the likes of Yaya Toure? Now, I did try to look at the players, try to get some recognition to see who the players were, and I could not tell. Now, if it's pointing towards the African Cup of Nations, you would expect there to be more dark-skinned people in these clips. There is a few, but it's pointing... I don't know where it's pointing. It's ridiculous. But anyway, guys, that is the speculation over. There will be some new teams coming into Ultimate Team, um, as you can see with the, with the footage and also the uh, players and things like that. But how it's going to come in, we do not 
not know. Now, if you guys want to speculate yourselves, you're more than welcome to. It's definitely not going to be new legends. It's definitely not going to be a new league, but and it's not going to be MLS teams either. It's something to do with Yaya Toure, and I cannot put my finger on what it is. Hopefully, in the next few weeks, we can find exactly who the uh, players are and uh, bring a video on that. But until then, this is as far as Investibateson has got. <laughs> Investibateson, that's the, that's the best we've got um, so far, but it's more than a lot of people have brought you anyway. So enjoy the video, guys. Try and smash over 5,000 likes. Subscribe if you're not subscribed and pass the information on to your friends and see if you guys can work it out before it actually does hit the Ultimate Team database. Actually, I lie. It's already on the database, but it's just not gone live yet. It was, this was glitched out, you know. So, yeah, until next time, see you all later. Have a very, very nice day.